Okay guys, it's me once again, and I finished that platforming stage from the last video you watched. And this will be a video showing off a boss battle. Alrighty, so I just, uh, when I came into this room right here, When I came into this room right here, there was three big monsters I had to fight and it locked me off so that I couldn't move except within the confines of this room right here. I beat those guys and this dropped right here. Once I break this, it'll give me some goodies and I'll go directly into that door right ahead. And that will signify a boss battle. See, I got all my stuff. And here we go. Uh, in every dungeon it ranks you uh, by various, I think, speed, uh, how well you exploit the enemy's weaknesses, and so on and so on. So at, this, at the end you can see I was ranked B right there. It, it's S A B C. I don't think it, I don't know if it goes any lower than C, but sometimes it's kind of difficult to uh, to get an S ranking because sometimes even though you're, you you have a party with you, you only allow three individuals, so you will have some enemies that will be weak, but you won't have those characters to exploit. So you're kind of screwed on that end. But anyway, let's go ahead, jump into a boss battle. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can strengthen my weapons. Nope. But as you can see right here, these are where if I have the uh, amount of materials, I can upgrade them, which I don't, so. Okay. I'm going to exchange any gems for yen, because this is a Japanese game, so. And you pick up these gems when you attack and kill monsters, or break open boxes or treasure chests. Okay, I'm gonna combine this ice sword. And to be honest, I have zero idea of what it does. I would assume it gets stronger, but I, honestly, I can't tell a difference. Okay, so with the, the, the yen I just exchanged, now I'm going to buy stuff. Cure potions. gonna buy a bunch of cures to be honest guys this game is pretty easy so you really don't have to grind you can just stock up on a bunch of consumable items and just brute force your way through the game I think I might have done like maybe four or five dungeons But I really didn't need to do those dungeons. I did them just because I like, you know, the layout of the dungeon. But as far as grinding, I haven't done any necessary grinding. I'll put it that way. There's none so far in the game. Your regular enemies 
are not hard to beat it's your bosses that's only because they're they're sponges you know okay so I'm gonna save in case I die which I haven't died anytime in this game yet guys my party has not been wiped out I've lost maybe one or two guys but since I have a bunch of uh, resurrection items I've never died my party has never been wiped out in this game in the 20 odd hours I've put in it and since I'm here on the save screen let me show you my hourly time okay details temple of twilight 30 hours and 19 minutes normal difficulty and that's my party so in 30 hours time I've never died in this game my party has not been wiped out Okay, so let's get out of here and let's go tackle some bosses. Come on. Oh, gosh. Yeah, finally. You can break their shield. And I can't see this guy. Look, he's got a shield of his own. Okay, because I'm, I, it's hard to play while I'm looking through a lens of this iPhone. So I'm just gonna pause the video, beat this boss, and then Pick up where I stopped it, okay? So you guys can see the ending of this boss battle. 